What's up guys, I'm here in Kanab, Utah for a annual family trip that we have and I wanted to give you guys a close up uh, tour of the Muley Crazy headquarters here in Kanab, Utah. Absolutely mule deer mecca, one of the coolest places if you're ever through here um, heading into the Arizona Strip through southern Utah at Kanab just on the very south border and it's famous because of where it's at mule deer wise. You're right between the Ponsagant and the Strip, two of the most premier legendary units out there and only at Muley Crazy will they have deadheads just chilling rotting away to chalk pretty grand entrance badass sign you get a thumbnail right there Go in and check it out. There's the 50 buck. As you can see, there's no deer in here under 220, I'm sure. And it's just piles of them. A couple of monsters that Ryan Hatch killed. That's one of his bucks. I think it scores like 270 something. Just piles of mass. There's just so many, I can't even get them all. Got Rockadelic and Old Man Grizz digging around. It's a cool buck I saw at the expo in Salt Lake. Look at the webbing and palmation on that right horn. And then also the bases on him are insane. Like it's, they're like probably nine inches, I would guess. Maybe bigger. What's crazy is it's just a four point frame. Just a freaking troll, but mass and characters and nuts. It's crazy how big, big deer really are. Vicente Buck from Northern New Mexico. A lot of these I've seen on old videos, but they're legendary. This is Alicia's deadhead she found. I believe that's Arizona Strip. Really cool lion mount. Big buck dead on the ground. Piles of sheds that got forgotten because they're not big enough. That's Jimmy John's Oregon auction buck. Uh, I think from like 2006 or seven, something like that. I believe he was high, like 290, 288 gross shot him in the velvet but that's just a replica just has so much going on 290 inch buck Arizona strip auction buck there's a cool recreation of him lots of footage lots of history with him Rocky and I were just admiring their sheds I mean these guys have this Epic no display deal. of sheds, and they're all just like 100 inch singles, 120s, 130s, tons of matches. I mean, there's so many big deer in here, you guys, you could spend hours. They're just, they're afterthoughts. I really don't think there's a deer in here under two, 210. And if he is, he's got super character to justify it. I mean, look at those. This one I have to show you. Look at that corkscrew dropper. Pretty impressive. A couple more that didn't make the cut. Just monsters. And up on the wall, these are a lot of just replicas of clients' deer, and I think there's some restorations up there. That's one I believe Ryan's dad found that buck, and they fixed him. I know he's over 300. Now, I think it's a Kaibab buck. It was on one of their videos. Big, massive slob. Like I said, guys, this is something you just have to get down here and see. You just, there's the, I think it's name is Snake Eye or something like that. You just got to see him in person. You just, nothing does, nothing will do him justice. 
Looks like a 230 typical. I don't know the story. I think that's Mexico re replica again. Tons of gear. There's Joe Dirt. Got tons of Muley Crazy swag. Optics. They can sell optics and uh, you can get them through us, through me, and or through Muley Crazy Direct, whatever. All the new loophole glass. They carry everything. They got the big knife, Night Force ATAX and Huskama G7 range finders. These guys have it all. Sig, big eyes. It's a one stop shop. There's the Broder Buck. It's a world record, non typical. This is a cool display of like six years of just pig shed matches. Showing that not all deer grow and add to their frame. Basically unchanged for six seasons straight. Pretty cool. Big massive troll. That's old Joe. Lion kill. I love that set right there. Short little stubby beams. Big old backs. That's Houdini. That's a legendary 300 inch Arizona strip buck. Again, just so much going on. You just have to see him in person. Just a slob. This is a really cool buck from one of the old Muley Crazies. Look at all the extras on the backs here. Scores like 270. And I'd say 30 of them are coming off those bases. Just fun to see what you know a big big deer looks like. You know, we we all have our trophies for our little general units, but when you're hunting the the legendary land with the legendary guides and the guys that do this for a living, you see what kind of potential mule deer really have, and they are badass. So again, Muley Crazy headquarters, it's uh, MuleyCrazy.com. Go to Kanab, Southern Utah, or Northern Arizona. I guess you could get to uh, very easily from the strip. And if you're ever heading that way, just swing by and check out the shop. I believe they're open Monday through Saturday, like 8 to 5. You can check it out on their website. But hope you enjoy the tour. Yes, sir. Dead and